on guys this is D I am back it has been a day or so since I've been on here and made a video um, I was kind of tired and I think I slept a, a lot yesterday and I've had some days off so it's been nice to relax but um, excuse my like wild amazing hair since I got this new hair I've been experimenting with things and I was going for a nice body wave today but I think I kind of like over bodied my wave a little bit but that's okay tomorrow it'll be perfect but anyways I still love it I'm excited. Anyways, I'm here today with a trick and a tip and a secret that I have and I've had it forever and you're gonna think it sounds ridiculous, but I swear to God it works really well. So this works for guys, gals, anyone who wears shoes. So you know when you buy some shoes, they've got this great rubber sole, like I've got like, let me grab a pair, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Like these, these ones I've got here great rubber sole on them like it's you're not going anywhere some jerk could spew, spill their beer all over the floor at a restaurant you could like strut right through it and like come out looking like a million bucks whereas there's shoes like my very favorite pair that I have to carefully tiptoe around because I'm not walking through anything and staying on my feet I'm on my butt because they're slippery as hell so what I've done and I've done this for years and I just thought about sharing it with you guys now um, and I don't know why I haven't done it to these guys yet because I I don't go out that often at night. I mean, obviously, because of COVID, so it hasn't been an issue. So um, this is going to sound crazy, but I grab a paintbrush from Dollarama and I go to Home Depot and I buy this or some version of this. This is Leak Seal. It's flexible rubber sealant. Now, the reason I got the idea was I saw commercials where they were like sealing pools. They're waterproof. They're like sealing pools with it, sealing pipes, doing all kinds of crazy stuff with it. And uh, they're, it's completely waterproof and it, it's a liquid. It goes on, you let it dry 24 hours and then it's a rubber and it's like a solid rubber and it's not coming off. It's a rubber sole. So I grab the paintbrush and I like, I usually will do like just, I'll stay about a quarter of an inch away from the edge of the shoe just to make sure I don't damage it. And I'll just do that part, the front part, especially this part here where you're gonna put most of your weight and where you're taking your, your instep where you're stepping first. There is the most important to get, get that coverage. So like stores knew this was a problem and they came out with those sticky things that were like sandpaper that you could stick on. If you get it in the wrong place, you're screwed because you can't move it. And it's like sandpaper, but I found they never really worked. They didn't work in any wet areas and they certainly were just garbage. And they would peel away after enough time as well. The other thing I found is if you got it in the wrong place, it made your shoe off balance. So you'd take a step and it would be kind of like, you're not on the right side in the right space. But with this solution, there's none of that going on because you just paint it on evenly, let it dry 24 hours. You want to put another coat, go ahead. I've never done two coats. I've done one coat and it is as good as solid as a store-bought rubber sole. And you can't really see it because you haven't hit the edges, even though you wouldn't notice anyway, because most soles are black and like the edge of it, like who, who the hell would notice a little black rim on the end of it? Like it would just look like there's a sole on the shoe and there is because you put one on there. But um, that is my secret for the day. You are not gonna slip and fall no matter what you walk through. Like it's not mud, nothing is gonna get you ice. You could walk like uphill in an ice storm in these, you wouldn't of course, but in any shoes and you're not gonna slip. You don't slip on the ice. It's totally awesome rubber sole. So. Anyways, again, just make sure whatever you buy, like I would look for a leak seal type of brand and make sure it says that it's liquid rubber, that it turns into a liquid flexible, flexible rubber sealant. Um, seals, leaks and cracks instantly watertight, protective finish. Like this one's black. You can get it in different colors. I guess that means I suppose you can get it in clear maybe. I don't know. But um, yeah, it, this one's Rust-Oleum. But um, I'd buy any brand. I just I saw this one understand. on a... I see it because you have... Yeah, that's Siri, but thanks anyway. Um, yeah, I haven't looked for any other brand. I saw it on a commercial, got the idea, tried it out, and it worked. So that's my tip for now, and um, that is all. I will see you guys all later, and hopefully you'll try it out and put it in the comments if it works for you. But um, definitely don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe 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 i have like i think i have 12 subscribers but i've got a lot of views so i either really suck or people just aren't subscribing so if i really suck tell me please and um if not subscribe it can't hurt thank you so much talk to you soon bye